Hello everyone. How's everyone today? Welcome to the Dirt Road Farmer. Well, we're on Deer Creek and uh, if you've seen my last video, uh, we finally got this field mulched, uh, but there was corn planted in it, so that means it has to be plowed. Uh, so we've got these two tractors running on course play. I apologize for the waypoint lines, but uh, <laughs> yes, as you know, uh, it's kind of necessary. Uh, but they're off to a good start, and I've, I've got faith in them. Surely they're going to get this done. But uh, I think I've got them set to do two headland passes, and then they'll do their up and down. So we'll just keep an eye on them. So far, so good. Uh, now, normally, I don't do the headland passes first, but Ben's course play is course play. Yeah, I thought maybe I better give them every chance that I can. So, we're just going to keep an eye on them and see that they stay off the fence and out of the trees. All right. Well, so far they are they are working flawlessly. I mean, real good. Uh, if they work this good, doing the up and down passes, uh, I'm going to be more than satisfied. Oh yeah, and they'll have this field done pretty quickly. But uh, they came down beside that fence, didn't even get close. So, yes, doing very well. All right, well, we're just going to keep an eye on them and make sure they keep doing it well. All right, well, they are coming up on the end of their headland passes. So now let's see where they go to start their uh, up and down. Uh, I don't know. I would assume that they will start over on the end of the field, the far end. Uh, but we'll just keep an eye on them and find out where they're going to start. Uh, evidently, <laughs> they know. So... <laughs> uh, it's it's hard to tell but anyway I'll get back with you as soon as I know alright looks like they're going to cut in right here so all right. It looks like they have a plan. Boy, it does look good. I really do hope they make it. Uh, if so, this will be the first time that I've had two tractors other than uh, harvesters uh, complete the job without crashing so let's keep our fingers crossed and hope that they make it well as you can see they're not obeying their convoy distance uh, and they've also had other problems that they couldn't find their path. But uh, I'm helping them get turned around 
and get on a path and they are making headway but it looks like uh, the tractor on the right is gaining on the tractor in the front that should not be happening whatsoever so I'm gonna have to stop him yeah see and yeah, that's what happens all right so we'll go over here and we'll get on this tractor we'll stop him get him run up there out of the way all right now we'll tell him to go let's go back to the other one tell him to go all right and see this I, I don't understand why they're running up on one another and not using a convoy distance uh, doesn't make any sense <laughs> oh jeez all right let's see if we can get this guy turned around here maybe starting back here a little ways I don't know that that's gonna help uh, I like the idea of this I really do uh, especially when it comes to harvesters but not if not if they're not going to obey the the uh, distance and I just this one on the right he just wants to run right up on the other one unbelievable all right All right, well, <laughs> oh, what a pain. I'll get back with you in a moment. Well, <laughs> as you can see, they're nowhere near working like they're supposed to. Uh, I don't, I guess they're working on it. Uh, I, I really don't know but I do know that this second tractor is supposed to stay 200 feet away from the one in the front which it looks like he's obeying now but as you could see while he was following no he wasn't he wasn't doing it at all so uh, all right, the first one has found a place to cut in. And it makes absolutely no sense to me. Of course, I guess it don't have to. But uh, seems like he should have cut in a little sooner than that. But I don't know. Now, it looks like I'm going to have to stop this guy because they're going to run into one another. So, all right, let's stop him. And let's run him down the field a little bit. And let's start him. Go back to the second guy. Start him. And see if they'll do what they're supposed to. It 
so far they are. <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, I'll, I'll just keep watching these guys. Make sure they don't run into one another or up on the fence. All right. Well, they've had a lot of problems following their paths. And I've had to help them on almost every turn. Uh, and I'll probably have to help them on these. But anyway, uh, for the most part, I think it's getting better. Uh, I slowed him down. I slowed the back guy down on his cruise control. And it seems as though that at least he's not constantly running up on the first one. Although they're both set to run the same speed. But, you know, that's the way it goes. But anyway... I think we're going to call this a video. Uh, if this information has been helpful in any way, uh, <laughs> I know that's, uh, yeah, that's helpful. It was just a bunch of problems with course play is what it was. But anyway, if you found any of it helpful and you want to use it, please do. Uh, if you've liked the content, please go down there and give me a like. I'd sure appreciate it. Uh, and if you'd like to see more video content from me, just hit that subscribe button. I'd sure appreciate that. It helped me out tremendously. But anyway, as a dirt road farmer, I think we're going to uh, call it a day. And as always... Thank you for watching.